We're talking this morning with Halei Saberi. Now, Halei, I saw you on Facebook. You're, we've been Facebook friends, I think, for a couple of years now. And yeah. I've been kind of following along. I knew that you did some modeling. But when I saw that you posted that you are now d- moving into the acting part and, and getting some major stuff going on, um, I wanted to get you on because I like the fact that there are people in our area, in the Twin Ports, that are working and, and chasing their dreams and acting and playing music and doing whatever. So I wanted you to talk a little bit about it. And so I'd like to start back with what made you get into this? How, when did you start? You know, when did you want to do this? Yes, I, as a dream, since I was 13, I always okay. wanted to be a full-time actress. Mm-hmm. But... I never get a chance uh, where I came from. I am Persian originally from Iran. Okay. I didn't get a chance to start uh, back home when I was there. Um, so after I moved here to United States 10 years ago, 2007, um, I started with modeling school in 2012. Okay. Because um, based on my culture, I was very shy and... I had to get rid of that camera shyness. How did you do that? How did <laughs> I mean? Was there a process that they worked on with you, or because I know there's somebody listening that says, "Gosh, I'm really shy too. I <laughs> want to be an actress, but there's no way." Yes, um, it's it's a hard work, but it's not impossible. Um, at school, the school I went in. Um, that the school still is in Plymouth. It's called Karen's International. Okay. Modeling is school. Modeling and acting is school. Mm-hmm. Um, I learned a lot about from basic modeling or um, model walk. Okay. Tell like how to represent yourself um, in front of the camera. So that's how start I started. And after I graduated, um, I uh, started with an agency um, as a model. Do they recommend that then, getting an agency right away in order to get work? Yes, that it just makes you organized okay. more. And um, just going to auditions or casting calls, even for modeling, it just gives you the experience. It helps you to find your weaknesses and work um, work on them. Okay. And also it makes you, it helps you to find your strength. Um on the areas that you're better than the others. Okay. Um, but the thing that helped me a lot to get rid of my camera shyness was shooting a lot with different photographers. Um, there is... Because everybody's got a different style. <laughs> yes, yeah. absolutely. They bring something different out Diff- of you every time. Different styles. Um, every photographer, they have their own style and um, the way they work. And it helped me a lot. Um, there's a thing called TFPs. Mm-hmm. So um, you trade your time with your pictures um, okay. with photographers. Right. So I did lots of those to just... Um, it just gives you practice in front of the camera. It's the same way with music. You, you when you Definitely. first get into music, you got to play on some projects <laughs> for free in order to get the projects that pay. Yes, yeah. definitely. Same, same uh, with modeling, and so that's how I started, and it helped me a lot to um, just get rid of my camera shyness. Okay. And um, that was almost a um, little over five years ago. And um, I, I worked very hard. It's, it's not easy. It's, you have to put um, lots of time and energy. Well, with and anything, you have to, you have to do yes, it in order to get better. Definitely. And mm-hmm. you really have to invest in yourself. Um, being a single mom with two kids, working two jobs, Cannot and going be to easy. school, <laughs> <laughs> and trying to do modeling and acting, it's not easy, but um, it's definitely possible. And I finally uh, started my acting career last summer with a web series, which we're filming that in Atlanta. Okay. Um, it's in post-production right now. It's called Consequences. So we can talk about it. <laughs> um, we, I know a lot we, of times they don't want you yes, to. Yes, yeah. yes. It's, it's, an act, uh, it's an action drama, and um, I'm very excited 
uh, for it to to get released. Um, I don't know when exactly, but I know that they're working nonstop. Um, on so when it you do, when you know it comes out, uh, maybe you could uh, let us know and we could link it. Oh, definitely. To the interview, Absolutely. that way people can check it out. <laughs> Absolutely, yes. I started with that, and I did um, uh, short films. Um, I would, especially as students, it gives, um, like, Do you get training? and experience. Is it kind of like the photographer when you work with different directors? It kind of, they kind of give you different uh, things to get better at? Yes, definitely. When you go to an audition... Um, it just, you find out if you're, you were prepared enough mm -hmm. for that audition and it gives you, uh, clues that what you have to work on to get better, okay. um, for your next audition. So I have been doing, uh, short films and, um, going to auditions, um, especially student films. It's a good practice right. to work with them and they're wonderful. Uh, because they re they really they really work hard because they want to get it done and they want to do it perfect mm -hmm. <laughs> for a good grade and well, they're and so they're, excited they're <laughs> wanting to get to that next level too yes. so yeah yes so um, that's how I started uh, last summer and uh, my Facebook page has been growing a lot and um, has been getting attention mm -hmm. from casting directors. Uh, producers um, so that's how I made my connections okay and I network with social media people. has helped a lot of people <laughs> achieve their dreams I tell you yes, both musically definitely. acting and film mm -hmm. wise and yeah yeah so um, that's um, that's how I kind of started and uh, my amazing followers and fans I I can't even thank them enough for their support and, and you need always, that you really uh, need that definitely i need that yeah. and i i wouldn't be where i am right now without their support and um i recently got um a role in a feature film um i can't say anything about it because i, I don't understand. have permission yeah. no i understand <laughs> um and another big it's role. star wars isn't it it's star wars <laughs> <laughs> I wish. <laughs> um, but another role I got is in a TV series that's in a pre-production, pre again in LA. Uh -huh. it's, um, it's um, New York Vice, and um, New York Vice in LA. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I will be playing a judge. Okay. <laughs> there. So what do you do when you get these roles? Uh, do you study for them then? Do you hang out with judges? And what do, do you call any that are local and say, hey, do you mind if I just kind of sit in and see what you do? Well, you don't have to necessarily uh -huh. hang out with judges. You can kind of like watch. Okay. Um, and uh, pick up the... Um, the important thing that you need for your role. Okay. But um, I just wondered if you sit on the couch with a big thing of popcorn and watch Judge <laughs> Judy all day or something. <laughs> no, that's not how it works. <laughs> um, See, I'd be a terrible actor. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, well, you have to do your homework. Right. Um, there are lots of great acting lessons online. Um, my dear friend um, just gave me um, one uh, as a gift. Uh -huh. And um, so I have been watching that. It's very helpful. Have you seen those master uh, that's things? The one. It, that's, that's master the one. Class. Yes. yes. Oh, those are great. That is like fantastic. It just gives you, starts from basic. And just step by step walks you through how even to read your script when mm -hmm. you get it, which is amazing. And people, some people, they think it's just so easy. You just, you just, you know, you just get the role and you just, you don't need to do anything. Get in front of the camera and, and just, just be you. Yeah, yeah, just be you. But it's not that simple. Mm -hmm. it's, it's a lot of work. Um, and I think that's practice, the bottom practice. line. In order to get these jobs and in order to be good at it, you really have to put in the prep. 
Absolutely. You have to work um, on your weaknesses. And um, because <clears throat> as an, I think most of the actors, they know what, which roles they're good at mm -hmm. and which they're not. So that's not too hard to find out after doing. <laughs> yeah, I would imagine you wouldn't, you wouldn't go for a role that George Clooney has a, <laughs> a shot at, right? Yes, definitely. But, but no, I would think that you'd want to, you know, do something that people couldn't see anybody else in that role. Definitely. Yes, that's exactly. Um, you have to find that about yourself. I did a short film with, um, uh, we filmed that in Wisconsin. Okay. Uh, University of Wisconsin. And um, the director is a professor there. And um, my part, my role, we only shot it once. Okay. And it just it just makes me so happy. I'm sure for every actor and actress, it's just it feels so good that you get it with one shot. You don't have to repeat it. Mm -hmm. And they say that I couldn't pick a better person for this role. That's what you want yes. <laughs> to hear from a director. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> you want a happy director. For yeah. Sure. Well, and the less time it takes and the less film, the Definitely. less the movie costs. And yes. I mean, it's good all around. Yes. I totally get that. So um, so now uh, you've got some things going. Uh, do you have plans to, you talked about going to L.A. a lot. Do you have plans to move there? Or are you just going to, do you like being in Minnesota? I love Minnesota because it's home for me. Um, I moved Minnesota from my country directly and I just started my life there my friends uh, which they're also my family mm -hmm. and um, I'm not planning on moving anytime soon I will just um, be traveling uh, back and forth <laughs> right and um, and I will see what future uh, brings me but not anytime soon. I, it's a long if road. If I can, yeah. yes, yeah. I will stay as long as I can in Minnesota. Probably I have, I will have um, place in Minnesota and LA um, to whenever I am there to stay. But um, I will avoid moving there, right? <laughs> as much as I can. Well, you have to. I mean, I would think that being in Minnesota, part of your personality is here. Yeah. And that's what's winning over the directors that are giving you these roles is who you are. Yes, definitely. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, I really appreciate you coming in and talking about this. And, and we'll, when we post this up, we'll have all the information about you. We can hook up whatever websites or, or Facebooks or whatever you have so people can follow you. Perfect. And uh, and we wish you luck. And then we'll have you back in when you're a huge star. <laughs> and, and I don't oh, know if I you know this. <laughs> I'm, I make this deal with all the big actors and all the big musicians. Is all I want is a lifetime backstage pass. That if I come and visit you on a on a movie, you just go. I know that guy. He's okay. Yes, definitely, <laughs> you awesome. have it from me. Well, keep up with us, and then as things start to happen, keep checking in, and we'll we'll let people know on on your progress and what's going on in your career. I will definitely do that. Well, thank, thank you, you so much. Thank you for having me. Mm -hmm.